Hey guys, this is Boston. Today I would like to review the OS which I have got recently, which I could say is a new update for my Moto Z Play that is no god. So let's go ahead and review all the features that which I have got with this update. Firstly, I can see a clear all option right from here, you know, the bottom of the screen. I can clear all the screens, you know, I can clear all the apps with one tap. While in Marshmallow, I need to clear each and every application. So that is kind of, you know, very annoying that I have to do each, swipe each and every app. Now I can just clear all. And that was a big feature, you know. And finally, there was an option called Data Saver. Now you don't have to worry about that you're supposed to run out of your battery and all. You can set you can set your data saver and, and all that can uh, let you to do several things like you know it stops background syncing from your social networking apps like a Twitter, Facebook, WeChat and whatever the app that you know using a background internet. So in that case you're going to to save a lot of uh, data from uh, uh, doing such thing you know uh, by enabling data saver so that is a big uh, future that you should get that you will be getting in this new god update and also one more uh, best uh, feature is the notifications now you can able to see all the notifications right from screen even if you can see all the information uh, from screen like you know like you know what I could say is sorry guys now you can able to view all your notification uh, notifications in a very great manner like you can extend it you can see a lot more information than it's normally it's supposed to be like you know if you get any notification here you can simply drag down to see more information let me show you that I don't know I just restarted this device now okay so that's the one future and the second one is the bundle with all notifications here like you know you can if you don't want to see this notification you can simply uh, block all the notifications you can click on that op option if you want and that that was quite great app and uh, what else you have is uh, the new setting application and you can have this this is a whole new design of the settings. I could say the design is the old one they have enhanced it in a very new way. Like, you know, now we can see it very organized and very polished UI. Like, as you can see in iPhones, basically. So you can get that type of uh, feel with this now got update. And let me show that what version I was running. Oh, what is that? Oh, there was a catty here. Catty symbol. Okay, I was running a no god uh, January level security patches January 1. Okay, and System UI Tuner which can be enabled by simply pressing down the settings bar here, you know, so that can be enabled. So it will ask you to remove if you don't want it because I have already enabled, enabled it. So I'm going to cancel it, however. So what this app is is you can enable all the things right from screen you know so ethernet you can also even enable battery percentage which will be showing here see it was showing up and this was a quite best you know best feature you should be getting and what else you have is uh, quick switching apps like i don't want to you know uh, double and uh, i don't want to press my uh, multi you know a recent app and I have to switch for this one it's simply I can tap it here double tap I can I can just you know get into my previous app so in this way you can easily multitask whatever the work that you're doing and this is going to help you in a very great manner and very you know very great way and what else you have is a multi window this is my one of my favorite application you know favorite future sorry <laughs> So what you can do with this app is, for example, you can set this app here. So it's currently not being supported. Okay, I want my settings should be here. And my second app should be here. So this app won't be supported. 
let me show you once again so you can simply uh, simply you press on the recent for two seconds then you will be getting a pop-up like like here show you can drag your ap application from the bottom of the screen and then you can choose the next one like I choose this one you know Gmail so now I can multitask here and this is the most awesome thing you know this was an excellent thing this was an almost amazing thing that I can do finally and multitasking true multitasking is this like you know doing two tasks at a time so that was the application and finally you now you can able to chase now you can able to have two tiles on the status bar you know like you can set whatever the applications whatever the toggles that you want here and this is one of the best one I can you can even change I guess yes you can even change like you know you if you want to set this battery up right there you can do it and also Eastern egg and nearby devices night screen okay I'm gonna put right here and also battery I don't need motor modes I don't guess that I need it and I don't use this one so basically I'll just throw it away and what I like is battery on one and this eastern egg because it's some it's you know it's like cool so so this is how you have to do it and and these are the best future switch covers and what else we have finally we have the display that you can able to change the display without even rooting the device like you know changing the dpa on dpi and all that stuff so let me show you that now you can simply head to the display and you can change the default size without even rebooting your phone so if you set large it will be like large it does take effect see now the apps are looking very large icons are pretty big but I don't like this however that was a good feature that you can set whatever size that you prefer and I just want to be normal like you know default so it does take effect without even rebooting so that should be something like you know a very great feature previously you can change this thing by changing the DPI that you have to you know brood and you need to enable the DPA settings and you need your scripter to enable that and that was a whole lot of shit that you have to do but that feature has been in the no gut update that you can do without even doing any kind of uh, stuff which have to be rooted and all so that's a kind of a new future so these are the new features which enhance your device very much